It is the 24th annual Run to Feed the Hungry. Are you ready to run? Since 1994, the Run to Feed the Hungry has led runners and walkers through the streets of East Sacramento on Thanksgiving morning. How are you guys doing out there this morning, Run to Feed the Hungry? 23 years later and tens of thousands. I hit a record this year for participants. What is it? We're over 29,300, the best ever. Thank you, everybody. Are still lining up for what has become an annual tradition for many. Officer Martin, good morning. How are you today? Hey, how you doing? Good. All right, all right. Here we are again. It's good Once to see again. you. That's like tradition for us. Is this your first time? No. <laughs> well, there you go. How many times has this been for you? Twelve. And a new adventure for others. Okay. I'm a first timer. I'm a first timer too. <laughs> step by step, this run is giving back to the Sacramento community. It's a big deal. It's the largest one day fundraiser for the Sacramento Food Bank and Family Services that they do. Nearly a million dollars is raised today. It's also the largest Thanksgiving Day race in the country. Who's ready to run to feed the hungry? A day for many to show off some fun and interesting fashion. A few years ago, we decided to dress up as cows because of our last name, Vodka. I'm a Luigi, and Luigi's my favorite Nintendo character, and I'm dressed up as Luigi because why not? It's a holiday. Very good, very good. When I think Thanksgiving, I think Nintendo, right? <laughs> While opening their hearts to families in need. Well, we want to um, make sure the homeless get enough food. A day we can all be thankful for. I'm thankful for my family. I'm thankful for uh, my kids, um, a great job. <laughs> what are you really thankful for this year? I'm thankful for my family. I just got back from college. Oh, and I'm so happy to be 